Hi, my name is Manjinder Singh Sidhu. I'm a human rights activist, author and speaker. I grew up in a traditional Sikh background where there was lots of arguments and fighting on a regular basis. This made it really, really difficult for me when I discovered that I was a gay man at the age of 11. I was very, very scared, um, so I decided for a couple of years to make myself straight. So for two years, I tried to imagine myself being with a woman. This is because the society I grew up in, grew up in they believe that boys should marry girls and vice versa. Ever since I was a small kid, my mum used to say to me, I can't wait till you get married and have a wife who gives me kids and she can go shopping with me for saris and make round chapatis. She put, embedded this into me and so the, when I realised that I was not the norm, um, it was very, very difficult and troubling for me. Um, so I, after a couple of years, I decided that I couldn't change my sexuality and I couldn't fulfill whatever my mom wanted. So I decided that I would accept what I was given and go and study really hard, go to university, get a job and live on my own and live the life that I'm meant to live. However, when I went to university in London, people used to always ask me, how do you feel about being gay and from the background you come from? And I didn't know what to say. I just ignored it and kept it to myself until I moved abroad to work for the UN in the Middle East. And in the, it, when I was there, depression came, sui I started having suicidal thoughts because I just did not, did not know how I would come out to my parents and tell them who I was. Luckily, my housemate at the time was going on a meditation retreat and he told me to go with him and I became very much involved in yoga and spirituality and positive thinking. I learned how to remove the guilt and the shame and how to um, basically emb embrace who I was. This came um, very helpful when I came out to my parents via SMS text message. They responded very, very well and uh, they accepted who I was straight away. This was a surprise. We looked for literature and um, for support groups in their language in Punjabi but we couldn't find anything. And that is why I decided to write this self-help book called Bollywood Gay for those in similar situations as myself. Inside, there's a section in 13 different languages which helps to explain to parents what it means to be gay. Though doing the work that I do, which includes life coaching and, and making YouTube videos and doing events and workshops, has gained me a lot of recognition. I have won countless awards both in the UK and in India and I've helped many, many people. And I'm sharing this story today with you to inspire and motivate you to also live your authentic truth today. Thank you.